hey guys welcome back to my channel rochelle hair so we are gonna make this two-piece dress check it out it is so beautiful if you're not already subscribed definitely click that subscribe button and let's make this dress so this is me i mean i know i know my hands look a little bit different but bear with me y'all so <laughs> So we are going to be measuring out or drawing out all of my measurements. We took my hip, my waist, my thighs, my legs, my butt. Okay. So we are just marking it out on this fabric. Okay. Just like this. As you can see. So this dress is going to have a band at the top of it. So we are making provisions. So it's like a high waisted skirt um, bottom, if you get what I'm saying. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and copy the, the front, okay, of the skirt, and we're gonna do the back now. So you see that little notch we're cutting out of the back? It's actually gonna be for the slit. You'll see. So the next piece is gonna be for the top. So again, he's just placing the markings for my bust, around my chest, around my ribs, and so on and so forth. And you know what? After making this outfit, it made me realize that I'm sure there are a lot of you out there who would love an outfit like this. And I've decided to become a designer. So I wanna collaborate with um, a brand, which we are friends, it's called Fufua. If you've seen my other videos, you've seen me in their clothes before. And so I want to bring these items to you guys um, that you can order. And it's for a good cause. I have a registered NGO called Helping Nations. And we're building a school in a village. And I think this would be a great way to raise some funds to go toward the project. And it'd be great for you guys too, because you guys would get like your own authentic Ghanaian outfit made for you. So um, comment down below if you would love that and would, if you'd love this outfit or similar pieces. Yeah, I think it's a great idea and I'm excited to actually um, make it happen. Okay, back to the dress. So these are the two halves of one cup of the chest area. It's hard to describe. So basically there is going to be a seam from um, the center of the breast. There's going to be a seam. So it's kind of like the front part of this top is in three separate pieces that are sewn together. So there's a center piece in the middle and then there's a piece on the side. But when he irons it out, you'll be able to see. So this is a seam that's that's going down the center of each of the breasts, if you get what I'm saying. So when he holds it up, you'll be able to see the cups. There they are. So those are the cups that were made with the three separate pieces. So those are the seams I was telling you about. So now he's going to attach the back piece, which is two separate pieces. So this part is the back. It's also going to have a curvature, just like the front. And this is where he's going to attach the two straps that tie on the shoulder. So these two flaps are going to be sewn in the armpit of the, um, the chest part that we saw earlier. So now he's actually gonna cut a little, um, it's like a finishing edge. 
I'm not going to be using any lining. I prefer no lining because the cloth in itself is not very stretchy. So I personally find that the lining just further restricts the movement. So I prefer no lining. So he's just going to finish the edge just like this. So there, you see the edge he created? He's just sewing it to the front of the top. And then he's gonna fold it back and iron it so you can't actually see it. Just like that. So these are the two back pieces. So this is where it's going to attach. Now he's gonna go ahead and put a zipper in the back. Zippers are always so finicky. So with that, the top is pretty much done. Now we're moving on to the skirt. So these are the darts that are gonna be in the skirt that are gonna, that are gonna create like the contour, like the shape to the actual skirt itself. And this is the slit at the back. The bottom. So as you can see, he's ironing it flat and that's the slit. This is the slit at the back, which will allow me to be able to walk. Now the skirt is almost done. He's just gonna measure it one more time to make sure his final stitches are gonna be in the right places. So now he's gonna be creating the band that is gonna go around the entire waist of the actual skirt. So it's gonna create that high-waisted effect. He's just lining it with, man, don't even ask me. I don't know what this is. <laughs> but he's lining it so he can create like a stiff um, structure to the fabric. So it'll be nice and strong around the waist. Now he's gonna go ahead and sew that waistband all the way around the top of the skirt, like so. Now this is the back of the skirt again. We're adding in another zipper for the skirt, similar to the one that is on the top. And this is it you guys, I am, I, I mean we, LOL, I mean he, he's all done. He's just folding over the bottom of the skirt so it stays folded and it stays closed with this kind of sticky paper. And that is pretty much it. So this is how the dress is looking all together. I love it. And you guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to comment, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and click the notifi notification, <laughs> notification bell. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, love you. Bye.